Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at HobbyFarms.com and they got an article on heating your house with your compost pile. A great article here by Lindsay Grossfield and she has a link to another helpful page I'll show you in a second. But we'll go with this picture. So they got some wood chips and on top of that, a coiled pipe. Now it looks like they're using a plastic poly composite there. You can use copper, which transfers heat very well. And they're filling it with water, and the water will transfer the heat from the compost pile, which can be well over 100 degrees Fahrenheit, 50 degrees Celsius. It's a good way to get renewable heat, because if you're building a compost pile anyway, you're going to have that heat. You might as well use that heat. So now we're going to native-power.de, and they're talking about constructing your biomiler. And it's a German word, roughly translates to bioreactor or biokiln. And uh, it's a great little design here. So they have a platform, and it has a sub pump for uh, the extra water to drain off into. And that water is a nice compost tea. And they talk about using a sub pump that has a float valve on there that will, when it reaches a certain level, it'll automatically pump it out and maybe pump it into an irrigation reservoir for some fertigation or maybe another separate bucket just so you can use some compost tea. But then it's layered compost layer of coils layer of compost layer of coils all the way up and then you just water it for until the internal temperature reaches about 50 degrees celsius and then you just let it go they recommend having a roof on it to prevent washout from heavy rain it's a pretty good system they got go over a lot of details and it looks like they have a compact version and a square si system and i've seen similar systems using ibc containers well, that's it for this story. You can read more about it in the links in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.